getting started on Tuesday, July 20th, 2021, 7-20-2021. Um, only a couple more days left of this week for me since I will be going up to Cincinnati on uh, Friday. Um, and plus, I got a, a gig on Thursday evening and stuff. And, and um, yeah, uh, made some money without having to do a whole lot booking a gig in uh, November. So, excited about that for a wedding. Um, but yeah, going out today. Had a good day yesterday. Um, hopefully, have a decent day today. Uh, had a really cool thing happen last night. Uh, when I got home, I had a, uh, a letter from my former bank, USAA, and it was a reimbursement, uh, a check for reimbursing me for two uh, insufficient funds charges from years ago. So it's an extra 60 bucks wasn't expecting, had no idea why it was there, but very cool, um, so yeah, um, going out hopeful today, uh, don't see any, so far I haven't gotten any orders really were taken, um, at least from sitting at home, and, uh, yeah, so hoping that I can get to a hot spot and start getting, making some money. So, I made a video last night talking about some things that are coming down from the, the good day that I had yesterday. Uh, sifting through some opinions on YouTube and all that that uh, people have on the way DoorDash is going. And, um, it's just funny watching speculations. That's uh, what we live, live in the world of speculations nowadays. Because uh, facts are all opinions and then we can't agree on reality anymore. So, uh, I'm excited to prove all these theories and strategies wrong uh, through my experience. So, in my, my market, it's never been a super lucrative, like getting something over $10 is very rare in my market unless it's a stacked order. Um, I have had a couple in the past couple days that have been over over $10. Um, sometimes thanks to the nudge of like a peak pay. Um, there was a dollar peak pay towards the end of the night last night, but I only took two orders in that. Um, it's really funny to see the, the orders just tank as soon as the peak pay comes on. It's not that the orders are tanking, it's just that the amount of orders that are being thrown out there, the, the, the ones that I see on my phone, just plummet. Um, which is really funny because I have a, I have a 4.97 um, customer rating. I have two, uh, three, I have a four star and a three star rating, whatever. Um, and I have two that are excluded for whatever reason. Uh, DoorDash saw it's probably because of um, like ones that were canceled because of either a mishap of addresses or whatever. So, and I have over 1,200 deliveries, but approaching 1,300 right now, um, which there was a guy who I used to watch on YouTube who I think had something like 1,600 deliveries, and that was like his five years or seven years or something like that, and you know, that was a badge of honor for him, which is really funny. I've only been doing it nine months, 10 months, already at 13, so whatever, they're at, to each his own, you know? It was more about YouTube anyway, going with the, uh, the easier way of making money. Which is, you know, um, I hope that one day I can, I'm aspiring to do that myself. Setting goals and going after them. So, uh, some exciting news. My uh, wife's going to be starting a new job as a teacher. Um, she was a, a paraprofessional in uh, public school. Now she's going to go be a, a writing teacher for a private school. Getting paid what she's actually worth. She had, I mean... We, we were driving by a public school and we saw that it was uh, they're offering custodians ten dollars an hour and she made as a person who got punched in the face had her nose broken um, took care of special needs children that uh, went through her uh, beat her up and all that other stuff but they're not children they're adults uh, between the ages of 18 and 22 and um, some of them are very big kids and uh, yeah she got paid 32 cents more than a custodian did so that's uh, for all of us 
out here in the DoorDash world complain about $2.50 base pay, um, I don't have a whole lot of sympathy. I would give up another $1.25 of that to go towards my wife's uh, hourly rate. Gladly. You know, it's it's stupid. Um, it's what it is, is that people people get concentrated on what is in front of them. They don't think about the things that are outside of their own little box as much as they want to and how righteous they think they are. Uh, things get forgotten. So, anyway, well, that's going to be it for now. I'll check in later tonight once I'm done with the, the day, see how the day went. Um, hoping for something positive. Go in, hoping for the best, expecting the worst. Um, just the way I live. Uh, this kind of job, uh, but I'm really glad I got the gigs and stuff that I got coming up, but uh, yeah, so check you guys later, have a good Tuesday.